today, let's play some more of our Bunta coup campaign in EU4. So we're going to do the uh, Silesia war really quickly and then wait for this guy to get over and do the Muscovy war over there. And then we'll use this guy to go and do Genoa and then we should be ready for Siberia soon after that. So that's basically going to be the thing. We pay loyalists to keep the liberty desire in our, most, in our junior partners' countries low and manageable. Most reports become more and more desperate and their pleas for money. Money they must be squandering, not using it to ensure the union remains in place. How is France actually looking? Um, we'd still just need to keep it there. It's 20%, yeah, so 51. Um, lose 50 admin, lose a lot of ducats. We'll lose a little admin since we need to spend it on something anyway. All right, and it's a new month, so our mothballed forts are... Right, still have no garrison. Because my I thought it was uh, April, I turned them on. All right, so now we're good to go on this lot. <clears throat> Nuremberg, Cologne, and Bohemia would come in. Nuremberg, Cologne, and Bohemia. Kind of want to put these guys... No, they're an elector anyway, so they'd have to disappear. Um, but wouldn't mind taking some money. So he'd call in Netherlands. Um, you know what? Screw them. It's just for the aggressive expansion that's on zero anyway, so... No, we will. All right, Trier, Mainz, we're using you guys up. Saxony, do we not have... He's in debt. And... Cologne is allied. Oh, right, he is. Well, before we do that then, um, Cologne. Let's buy them up a couple. Just keep him super happy with us, and we're not going to get that alliance back, so it should be okay. Uh, Silesia. Declare war. Bohemia, Trier, Mainz. Confirm. Alright, so big old 52 stack comes rolling in with Ekbert Kint. Land fire damage, extra 10%. Alright, helping hand, 5,000 manpower, nice, thank you. Uh, Cologne, Nuremberg and Bohemia are honoured, done in Kazan. So we're going to Pronsk. Finish in November of 87 and December of 87. Well, got them kind of close-ish. Uh, Nuremberg's going to hit the platinum. The grasslands. And, yep. Yeah. Alright, there goes his army. Ottomans declare on Yemen. 1.1% attrition there. Should be okay. Osnabrück. Under attack by the Colonish. And Netherlands have come in. Yep, yeah, assumed they would. So did we lose? No, I didn't lose any trust of that. Um, we're going to be friendly towards them. And yeah, money's not good with all the forts turned on. We're getting all the benefits. Three and five. Well, yeah, it's a level one fort. Alright, after this we'll head straight down to Prague. Somebody else do this. Uh, we go there. A Commonwealth. Go do that. And France. A little busy, but when they're not, they'll come over here. And we've got the rain and them. It's supposed to be supportive. I don't have a whole lot of troops of their own. Seven and eight. Commonwealth's built up nicely. You know what? If they're building up like that, they can just be aggressive. Alright, Antorf. There's farmlands. So yeah, knocked out all the forts we had along the uh, Commonwealth border. It'll save us a little bit of cash. So we're not going to need them anymore. There's rather a lot of Bohemians. Alright, regulate the doctors. This is two years, so it doesn't matter. We just grab that. Clev is under attack, and back at the admin limit. It's not quite a new year yet. We'll wait for that ten percent swing. Um, where are we doing them? No, Not that one. This one. Um, in livestock provinces. Seems fair enough. Still a couple there we kind of need to do to get them over ten. Um, don't particularly want to spend it now because we're going to need a lot of points for the coring we're going to go with. Why is 
Why are we allowed to do 1041 when there's no penalty? Huh? So, minus 71. Pretty good. Uh, unrest reduction. Don't mind if we do. And a last core over on Goldingen. Oh, let's climb on Munrum. Damn it. Alright, well. Just declare the war now so we can get started. Take Solikumsk. Confirm that. And I'm just gonna chase after these guys first. The French army's still just sitting there. But we've got Prague. Hmm. <clears throat> So, what do we want to do with them? 85. Uh, I want to take Cheb back. I just want to leave him with Prague. It's fine, though. It's Islands, Grasslands. Take, you know, which one of these is the worst? Bruno. Oh, we definitely want Prague. Alright. We want that, 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 and that if we can. Almost could now. And that's fine by everyone. Uh, we still need to take this, but yeah, I think we can do this. Uh, a lot of cash would be good. And just take some more reps from him as well. So, yeah, we'll uh, go and spread out a little bit. Uh, France. It's not just the fact that he's sitting there doing nothing, it's the fact that. He doesn't even have enough supply to sit there doing nothing. Supply limit's 40. Alright, <laughs> we actually caught them. Forgot we were going after them. Um, mm -hmm. They have no forts, so their capital's over here in Morom. I guess we're going to go move this guy over. And then uh, Commonwealth probably do a lot of the rest of that for us, hopefully. Alright, do you want to get another claim? Already claimed everything down there. Probably going to lose them soon. Seventeen hundred. All right, Got a little bit of time. It's the easier one out. Too bad. Um, we could actually chew down Cologne a little. Leave him with just Berg, maybe. Take Paderborn for ourselves. Don't know. Maybe later. Alright, um, get over to Olamook just in case we need it. There goes Bruno, so... Looks like we do. He actually goes to Chad with this guys. So find that easier. And yes, they are coming in. So, let's get over to Perm. <clears throat> Start spreading these guys out. Never win Papal Controller. It's been so long. Uh, I've got enough to be ready for a guy to die, though. And, damn it, we've got... Alright, uh, we've got Morom. Get to Betluga. And, time to do this. Ooh, advanced CBs already. Oh, crap, it's that late in the game. Okay, well, yeah, we need that. Going to drop some of these extra guys. Probably straight after this war, actually. Um, what do we got? Mainz and Trier. He's fine, and Trier we can buy up now. It's all good. Really don't need them anymore with uh, France and Commonwealth on our side. Alright, we have Olubuk. And that is done. I guess we could just get over to Berg really quickly and take some land. See how the aggressive expansion is anyway. Go to Berg. Hello France. He's sorted his guys out. Actually has two. Good. And these guys are not. Hopefully he sees what's going on. There he goes. Alright, so with that Lugadon. Uh, should be okay to spread out a little. Eat some of these guys. And put together some artillery. Alright, and I assume that they've finished their core here. No non core province, yeah. So Ravensburg is no more. I guess we can just force them to release him if we go to war with him. 
It'd be a better idea that way anyway. Right, and over here. It's got one dude on Marom. Good luck with that. Gulch. That one. Right, let's go down there and then come back to Stardom. Alright, got Pustug. Let's get him down here. Get this way and then uh, meet over that way. A mighty fortress in Vermont. Alright, so when I looked, these guys were at 98. Now they're at 78 because of our tech we just took. So that's all good. And up to 84. It's actually the absolute maximum is going to be 90. Hmm. And what have we got? England's taking Louisiana. Okay. Oh, Florian Kerhan died. Damn it. Our best dude. No, Ekbert Kint. Florian Kerhan. We're not using him. Um, he was the two siege. But yes, Bohemia, you know, to die. Von Stad, who we never got to eat. We're going to take these and leave him with that. Turn to Moravia, no. Uh, and old treaties, we don't need prestige, so um, end it on that note. Go for it. Alright, so the problem's going to be we have to finish these before we can do much with Muscovy. Where are we actually at around here? 30. 39 is probably the highest. And that's okay. Austria cared more than the people we took the land from. And it's not an awesome fight to get Fabio up there. And these guys coming up here. Down to Castroma. You know, we should probably actually have a look at what we're allowed to take. Um, so let's take slightly less than 60% overextension. Might actually get lucky. Huh. 54? 58? 66 for the whole lot. I do want to do them in one war. So we'll uh, take their land, we'll kill their people, and then we'll sit on it until the other cores are finished. Alright, need to go... Th actually, it'd be quicker if we went this way. Alright, Nuremberg. We war with Nuremberg. Hello, Nuremberg. Um, we don't particularly care about you in the slightest, so give us all your cash so we can pay off some loans. And then... Um, that's probably about it. Trade power. Go for it. Alright, uh, did them. Need to do these guys. So we're going to leave them with Berg, right? Uh, take this one and Cologne. It's only worth 13, so that's all good. Uh, not releasing. Well, it wouldn't be a terrible idea to release Clev, would it? Clev get Berg, which means he gets Paderborn. And we take Cologne. Costs a little Diplo. Plus war reps. And now it's only Austria that gets over. Um, sure, send that. Now, Clev. Uh, you, Willing, absolutely loves this from Released in Peace. He is a uh, administrator, so he should want to be a free city. Why not? Because our Diplo rep's dropping because we're taking land. Fair enough. I'll try and remember that for after. Get the next one started, and then over in the Netherlands, I think we just want to piece them out. Who else is in this war? Just Sleasure in the Netherlands. Alright, so we'll just go two days from now. Um, take... Taking this one, right? Yeah, we'll leave him with Glowgirl. And let's so piece for this. I guess we could ask for Brabant. Starts causing issues. Um, 
the thing wouldn't actually form, but let's just leave that alone. Alright, uh, which means we're going to go just white piece for the Netherlands in case we want to get back. Actually, we'll take cash. Oh, hell yes. Alright. France is over there. No, we'll just ask for what we can get. We'll do another one, two, three, minus. Well, we can wait until next month because he can't finish that. Okay. And now we can get quite a bit more. 3,400. Thank you very much. Alright, out go the Dutch. Let's go check on these battles. Alright, it's that one. It's obviously going to be a victory anyway, but let's go around. Um, he's already on the way up there, so you can go to Uxusulsk or whatever. And over here we'll get to Zhevsk. He's locked to coming in there. That should be the end of his armies, hopefully. They're already gone. Alright, we'll wait a month. Um, yeah, end of whatever. So let's go for a 20. A diggy. The next one will be a 19. Alright, I don't have to put everyone else together. He's gone. So hopefully that's all the armies and it's all his land. So he can't possibly come back. And over here in Silesia. We sue for peace. It's just him and us. We want this one. And none of them matter. So war reps and transfer trade. It is a couple of people, but it's December now, so Silesia downwards should come out of this. Bohemia and well Moravia could do a thing with Austria. They'd have to be complete idiots to actually do it. Alright, send that. And that puts us on 60.5 that we'd be allowed to do with Muscovy 60.5 we went took everything but Marom we could do it now don't particularly want to come back for another war later though nah screw it well want to get it done sooner you know what that's fine um, take his cash give him a chance to get some more let's just get rid of these then as well A lot more there I'd like to get rid of. Um, no, we need the money. Alright, fine. Say goodbye to him. Hamburgian Eastern Europe now has a proper font. And crap. How did that go so wrong? Oh, because we took the other ones after. No, I didn't. Alright, it's fine. Do we want to be this far over for this long? Becomes the next question. Um, Twenty percent over, because we took uh, Old Mutz and Prague and all the rest. I'd have to get rid of quite a bit. I don't really want to. The Jinsi will come back up, get up to ninety. Um, strengthening the government would be a waste of points. That uh, should be fine. First one. To fit, well, it's going to be years worth. We're going to get some nastiness. Which means we may as well have done this, but at least we're under 150, I guess. Yeah, Rurikovic. We'll lose Rurikovicism. Uh, exiled army in Berg. Well. These guys can walk through France and sit down here. They should be able to. No, we can't get through him. Um, I do want a black flag dude down there. So get through these and then we'll be allowed to stand in Dauphin. Whereas these guys can't get down through that way at all. They can get to here. Alright, I guess they stand in Hessen. And 
We've got some support back here for the numerous problems that are going to exist very soon. Why is he's not actually suffering attrition? No. Alright, um keep the fort in Kazan, and then these guys can stand actually over here and in turn. Alright. And Bronsk is done. So, don't want to accidentally do one of the ones. Uh, I think we've had Majar for a while. Don't want to accidentally do one of these ones that aren't being cored yet. And we've got about two years we can change our focus. I think this was the big one that we were doing. So after this, we will switch to military, try and knock that idea group out ASAP. I'm not such a piece. And we can repay the loan. Good timing. Alright, go with this and this one. Next month, get the last one started. Sol Galitskaya. No mines. Oh yeah, we need to drop those allies, don't we? Um, to deal with this whole 11 out of 7 thing. So, Mites and Trier and Saxony. Um, Saxony, did we have... Oh, Unholt, seriously? Um, yes, we can buy them back up a little. Keep them around for another two years. Nah, no. Alright, break the Royal Ties. Uh, looking for Mites. Dissolve that alliance. Trier. Dissolve that alliance. And Saxony. They're gonna really hate us for this. <clears throat> Alright, um, dissolve this alliance. So that puts us on 8 out of 7. Much better. Sweden. Commonwealth, France, Lorraine Planet, Castile, Transox, and Ming. Transox would be one to get rid of, but I liked calling him in against the Ottomans. So we'll keep him around. So we've got a decent amount with him. And he's Sunni, so... I doubt that he'd call us into one to be useful. Uh, Fars is Sunni, so... They're actually allied with Transox. Okay. Um, start building up the work down there. Anyway, we'll call Transox into a different war to go to war with Fars. Still want to push through to Bachmanis as quickly as we can. Because we want the gems that I thought were down here somewhere. Gems, 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 gems. There's more in other spots, but it's actually part of Fars. Alright, well, start getting our gems together. Uh, lose legitimacy. Awesome. The bloodthirst shown by Conrad II has ruined the reputation of Hamburg in the eyes of the world. I assume that's probably part of uh, being too far over. And Ashanti have declared independence from France. That's unfortunate. Boy, are separatists over there. It's only one province, though. Oh, and he's come back into the Cape Coast. Wait for him to finish this time before we eat it. Okay. And how are we doing? Over here on Siberia. I want to fabricate all the claims. Kurgan, I guess. We'll keep waiting because we can't go to war with him for a while anyway. Um, now, next thing. Don't really need some of these forts. I was going to keep Kazan to deal with all of those. Um, Nizhny can drop theirs though. And how are we actually looking? 40... 50 on Perm. Perm is going to trigger. Muscovy is going to trigger. Which was... Well, we had these armies here, but I don't think they're going to be big enough. It's a 44 and a 46 stat. Okay, then. Um, 39 supply, 34 supply. Kind of sucky. Let's at least get them close enough together to be able to reinforce each other. And money's looking okay. Alright, what are these? Moravian revolutionaries. Um, who is not a free city that might become one? 
outraged. Fair enough. Um, who did, yeah, that's right. I'm doing Silesia. He's militarist and hates us. Um, he's a 50-year-old militarist. Who's the one? Clev just got spat out. Grand Free City must have 10 development. He's got 9. That's unfortunate. Uh, Memmingen. Enforced religious unity. Why did that come out Protestant? Um, currently have him as a militarist. You know, I want to just do that. It's only going to cost us one, so that's okay. You know, still have four votes, five votes. Cool. Uh, Mites barely vote for us, so may as well improve with them. An extra fifteen. Saxony still vote for us as well. And lose a cardinal. Alright, Mainz gives up ducats and I'll with Alsace. It's all good. Boyo actually beat Castile even though his army was there. Ouch, that sucks for Castile. Alright, Silesia, Munster, Burgundy say no to all. Permians are at 80. That will trigger somewhere. Probably Perm. Alright, and see how we hit this other 30 stack. 26 stack. Can I sneak through. That's alright, because they're under France still, aren't they? There's a vassal of France. So I guess down towards Switzerland, and then it's not far to Navarre. So yeah, keep those armies there. And here we go. Yuriev and Vladimir. Well, that's already part of the problem anyway. One would assume. Yuri Evan Vladimir. Yep. So that's fine. That'll just trigger. Now, problem will be... Um, where are we looking? This one. That's Muscovite. This one is Permian. Problem's going to be if they both trigger at the same time. They're at 90. And Muscovy is at 80. Alright, what's the uh, monthly? 75% chance per month. Okay. Stop trying to improve with Mainz. Recall from him and go back to Saxony. Hello, Castile. Crusade against Songhai. And the Ottomans. That is going to really suck again. I don't want to be at war with the Ottomans, but don't want to lose them as an ally. Uh, too bad. We should be up to 20 by now. Almost up to 30. Oh, we can wait until next month. Maybe boost this a little further. We'll auto decline, but we'll try and get that done in time. Okay, uh, Lower Don and Borisoglebsk also suck. So, Castile. Let's actually see if the Ottomans join in, I guess. It's declared on Songhai. So, it is as Defender of the Faith that the Ottomans are going to come in. And Austria's disputed succession. What in Habsburg becomes von Eggendorf? Same dynasty as Baden. Aren't they the ones under... They are. It'd be nice if you could tell them to fabricate a claim on Austria and then we'd go push it in for them. Don't have a thing. There is a vending court to arms from Castile. Of course there is. So it's January. And there's the Permians. So this is the point that we should have the extra one. Because it said January of 89. But it always takes an extra couple of months for some reason. Alright. Permians. We... Uh, how do we want to do this? Let's throw them directly in. And do a crossover afterwards. I'd like that they have spread out. And that's Fabian in there. We want the other dude. Ekbert Kint. Then Alexander Alpers is fine as well. Alright, crush them. And it was the next month, so we can't get over there in time. That's unfortunate. Alright, um, back to Castile. Keep an eye on that. And we declined. And he absolutely hates us for it. That's okay. 
We'll maybe go and conquer him instead. Alright, got them. Let's just rush straight over there. Taking Sazdal, taking Maluga. Fine. It's annoying that they're where we no longer have a fort. I was supposed to wait another month. Um, we can defend the faith. Because we declined the call to arms, we lost it. And we lost part way through the thing. And um, we do have the money, so there's no reason not to. And let us convert Taki. Alright, Chukachek and Urja get Rebel Sentiment. That's our third one. You know what? I'd love to get PU over Austria. Is there a possibility? Uh, Royal Marriage is just because he's outraged. Let's go and prove with Austria. And how are we looking up here? 107.5. We look weak, but it is temporary. Apparently, we're down to 61. It's pretty bad. Imperial liberation on Unholt. 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 Hmm. <clears throat> we have no diplomats. Do we want to liberate anybody? Who would we liberate? We'd just be liberating uh, Saxony. Saxony, Saxony, yeah. No, they can keep it. Bad reputation. Lose more prestige, why not? And uh, they lose influence, that's okay. So all those finish. Um, is it time? Ten years from now, it's the halfway point. Hello, France. Magistrate resigns. Lose diplo that we really don't have. Alright, and when exactly? 28th of November next year. We can switch over to better military. Um, those cheeky buggers have wandered off. As have those. So, I guess we have a crack. And Alpers. Had to be the guy that was in there. Um, Alexander Becker. Alright, one that, one that. More separatists, Tula and Promsk. Aren't they just going to be annoying? Alright, invest in prestige from land battles. Um, no. Although we could do with the prestige. We're getting a tiny bit of army tradition, that's it. We can get another 30 dudes in our force summit. Maybe. What's this one? Fars. Alright, fine. And Rostov is ours. Oh, we need to say a piece to push the button, um, Austria has come of age, so nobody wants to vote for us anymore. That could be problematic. And it's going to get worse when we do this as well. Ah, crap. Alright, local militias. Gain the last bit of army professionalism. Um, I don't want to think about this right now, so we'll just do the sheet. We will actually want to buy them up. Hmm. <coughs> Alright, gain that last bit. Vladimir is ours. And give us our things back. Would be for cavalry and mortars, not for infantry, but yeah, we'll sort that out laterwards. So, um, problems in the Great Horde. Lower Don. Lower Don. It's down there. Let's go stand in Lower Don plus Belgium. was the worst one. Alright, uh, next month. No, next month. We'll be able to fabricate the other claim. <clears throat> now, Genoa. Uh, we need to do this before... 1700. And where else? Nerim and Tabikti. Sure. Why not? Just need... Well, any of these done. 8th of May. 8th of May. Alright, 8th of May will be the end of it point, which means we can go to war with Genoa. No, we actually 
don't want to do them until that's down further. So, Cybia. Hope we get a claim on Iglino. And pull the man back. Alright. Um, well, it's going to be a short war, so just take half of these troops over and deal with a Cybia. Get all that back. Hello, Sweden. And our Commandant has passed away. Get another one. Land maintenance could be useful. Actually, this guy's half price. Half price land maintenance. Do we care that much about the money at the moment? We don't particularly care about discipline at the moment, so yeah, let's just go for fat stacks of points. There we go. Um, this guy is not half price and he's too old to buy up. It's all good. And how did we forget to do this province? Just had to run away, I guess. Um, he might actually be going over there to do it for us. So, head through just in case he is. He is. Oh, what a lovely friend. Alright, um, done improving with Austria. We wanted to get the royal marriage, which we could do. Trust's way too low to be able to get a thing, but it would be all about making him one of us. I really don't see that happening when he's 16. Screw it. Give it a go. Incredible would that be. Alright, recall the diplomat. 3210. That will come home on the same day and send one off to Cybia. Actually, we're at 48. Let's go. Now, this is finished. Um, add it up. So I'm 49.27. So, yeah, easy just to do Ursul. Alright, 58.5, whatever. What's your problem now? Doesn't have support anymore. They're all very hateful people. Minus 16, that's us. <clears throat> Minus 35, economic power, because we're overextended. Well, it's the 8th of May, has this come down yet? There we go. Can we do it now? Now we can. Uh, by one. Alright, and this is for tax income. Evigaland Frieda disallows internal HRE wars. That sounds good. So, let's go doing the thing. Alright, one, two, oh, that takes forever. Three, seriously, just let us paint it on. Or do it by state, maybe. Add every province in this state to the HRE. Uh, that's ours. Alright. 13, 15. Probably going to be spending most of it to pass this one. Problem's going to be if uh, Austria takes over and then passes the one that makes him automatically inherit it. Twenty-six. Yeah, I'm wondering if we want to focus on. Um, seriously, not. Why are we not allowed to do that? Must be Christian. Well, that's fair enough. Um, yeah, well, that's going to be an issue in most of these. Um, yeah, if we want to win, inherit. Uh, unnaturally, the Commonwealth and France at some point, focusing on Diplo. Probably will in the end. Alright, we can do Rostov. Alright, 42. Alright, actually it snuck around the back here. That's 48. I so there's a highlight for ones you're allowed to add. There we go. 50 on the dot. But 13, 4, 16 against. So, who is against is the first question. Opinion from the Netherlands is too bad. Really got to start letting all of them get access whenever they ask. 
minus 6.2 because of opinion in Magdeburg. He's the bishopric that we can't uh, do the thing with. Hmm. Nice to have the list of who's saying no. Overextension. Looks like it's being a big issue again. Alright, so we need these three votes. We have to take... Yeah, we have to take those three. Alright, Tria. We are too old to deal with this properly. So we're just going to go bad on the Diplo. Four, eight, and minus nine. It's a bit rough. Um, mm -hmm. Alright, repay the other loan. I think that was the only two we took out. So improve relations with him. That will be enough. Uh, Trio we're going to improve as well. And Mites. Alright, we'll go to Fars. And you know what? Pull this guy out too. So, yeah, improve with them. Go down. Oh, we're allowed to pass it now, are we? <laughs> Getting them to like us was enough. Actually, the overextension just finished. So, Fars, we fabricate for Hamadan. Alright, next ability. Oh, so close to getting that. We want to get our golden era during this age because we're not going to do parliament. We are an emperor. We have a powerful subject. Um, can't remember what the thing is for high discipline, but we probably have it. We'll have a large capital. Actually, we can just do the golden era next time. Great leader shouldn't be too hard. And controlling institutions might actually be possible. Alright, so last thing here is going to be... Flexible rivalries, just in case we need it. Alright. And, right, good on Fars. So, they need to come back. And we can pass this. 50.15. Abigail Landfrieda, 15 to 14. Yep, swinging those guys was enough. And he's flipped back again. No. He was already... Yep, no, fine. Alright, Abigail Landfrieda. Disallow internal HRE wars. Which, there is still one ongoing somewhere. We get prestige. Members get tech cost reduction. Go for that. So, proclaiming Herb Kaisertum is the last one we're going to need to do. Which means it's going to be a while until we can drop these guys out. Oh, seriously. Um, Saxony. Let's just get the royal marriage with him. And then his opinion will come up so we can do the rest. No, we're going to die. Seriously, what's with the stuttering? Alright, Yemen seeds to the Ottomans. They continue to grow. 2 1 0. Go for that. Then he likes us enough to do this in a month. Alright. Alliance is a go. So, back to having 13 out of 7. And what the hell has Austria done? Alright, Mary Reed. Blah, blah, blah. Admiral 523. Um, rather just have the admin. So where is Austria coming from? Large nation in the Empire has always been there. Must have just got his Diplo rep back or something. Uh, we can get an extra bit from bumping up legitimacy. How oh, are we? We're 51. This is dangerous. Alright, so we just need to make sure that we win the election, first of all. And knock this up another couple of notches as well. It's always good. Overextension will be gone pretty soon. We are still improving with them. We're actually not. He's done now. He's got 10 more. He's got 11 more. Oh, damn it. Um, well, we can guarantee them now. Guarantee him and... Guarantee him. Guarantee him and... Well, Saxony. Okay. 
close, but not close enough. What are we missing here? Can't get relations up high enough. Um, aggressive expansion, broker or marriage, broke alliance, and refuse military access should come down kind of quickly. All right, Transox comes to the raid. Conquest of Herat against Khorasan. Mazandran, Delhi, and Fars puts us to war with Fars. But I guess we can just accept that one. And next point is we want to start thinking about converting in a better order. This one, Saratov. And we can add this blob. Okay. Exiled in Borariska. Why are we not allowed in Baden? Still a vassal of France. Okay, well, we could um, black flag our way down there now, I guess. And Alexander Backer is dead. Alright, um, we are at 99.31. Well, let's put Fabio down here. Can't do it in French land. Alright then. Um, Fabio can go here, and he's just going to be doing his thing on there. England, another valid rival. That helps get this back up. And trade embargo. We shall revoke. And yes, as soon as he gets in, get him a drilling. Yearly army freshism 0.1. It's um, not good enough. Alright, 2, 1, 0. They're all home again. So. We will have two votes. The other thing is controlling other electors. If we if we die, then it's not going to give us... No. Alright. Well, it's January. We need to bump this up that last tiny little bit we can get. And then Trier. Allied to rival. Yeah, if we hadn't broken those alliances, it would be... Fine. Damn it. Um, we'll maintain in Cologne. So we need to get that. Saxony is a lot closer. Maxed out. Alright, maintain in Mainz. Maintain in Saxony, maintaining there. Oh god, if we lose this, you know what? We can get a paper legger. Gives us three votes. Didn't quite get us tree air. I have to wait a year for the rest of them to tick down. So, just because I know that we're going to die if we don't do this, um, let's send. Actually, transfer trade power does some as well, doesn't it? It does. There we go. Uh, Saxony, give us your trade power. And screw you guys, you're all going to transfer. Okay. So, it sorts out that. And yes, we are technically at war. And who has just ceased to exist? Mainz accepted a piece of tree air. Mainz has been phalanxed. Fine. Um, tree air, we can't really demand it from you, so we're going to need to plant somebody else who's going to vote our way. Um... That's not what I'm looking for. This one. Opinion. Commonwealth of France. Lorraine. Can't make Lorraine one, can we? Because he's under us already. Grant electorate is a subject. Yep. Uh, Baden is subject to France. Fair enough. Um, opinions of us. Right. Sweden. Clev. Clever Clev. He was supposed to become a free city doesn't have the development. Mm, we'll look for somebody else. Uh, Cologne is Transox, Trier, Papal States outside. Burgundy, pretty sure is a free city. Saxony, Castile, Austria, absolutely not. Um, Aragon, Switzerland. They are in the HRE. 
What's their opinion of Austria? He hates Austria. Alright, um, it's a bit of a gamble, but grant him an electorate. Their opinion comes up automatically. He has accepted. And then we just improve with him from the next month. He's voting for us now, so that's good. One, two, three, four. So we don't actually have to keep Saxony, because Switzerland's better. Alright, improve with them. We can improve a little bit. Cool. And that Songhai was finally over. I don't think the Ottomans ever actually ended up going into that, did they? He didn't, so he could have gone into that war. Okay, well, don't need to demand that from Trier. Although, we don't need one of these votes. Screw it, let's ask for it. See if you will accept. Um, so I want to make mites of free city then. So, Trier, over there. Um, one unlawful territory, mites. Yes, go. Thanks for handing that back. Trier won't vote for us, but we have four just. And then Mainz, unfortunately, still bishopric. So that didn't work out. Okay, well, yeah, I'm going to take a short break here. And when we come back, we will work on passing the next reform, which is the big one, Kaiserutum. So thanks for watching. See you soon.